Quick test, quick test, quick test, quick test, testing, testing, two, five, six, two, eight, one, three. All right, sounds like everything's going all right. I hope everyone's having a wonderful, wonderful kind of sort of day. And I'll get started. Oh my gosh, you know what I did? I forgot to plug in my camera. <laughs> okay, so that's a fun. It's a very pretty picture of a moon, don't you think, though? Yes, I agree. Let me see if I can do this. Is it a late start? I did miss on the 10 to attend your schedule time. I'm not going to lie. It's a, it's a late start on my part. I accidentally did this. Um, it was supposed to be a little earlier than this. Um, but I got caught up in, unfortunately, some business that I had to take care of. And so this is a little later than I intended. But fortunately, it means I don't get, to, I don't get interrupted by accident. However, what could interrupt is the fact that I don't even have a camera all set up. So this is going to be fun. I was worried I got confused about the time zone. I'm in Central. Nope. No, 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 no. Unfortunately, it's kind of like, now that, like, so now that my contracts are now open again and all of them are starting to come to fruition, the timing gets a little bit on the wonky side. So I'm not particularly certain exactly if I'm going to maintain that same earlier afternoon schedule than before or not. Um, but we shall see. The goal is to be able to do just that. Uh, yes, can can we activate this? Okay, can we start it up? Mm-hmm, 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 yeah, uh-huh. Mm-hmm, yeah. Maybe, turn on, turn on. I'm not actually sure how to turn it on without restarting the whole thing. So, what I'm going to do is I think I have to close OBS and start it up again. I'm not sure why, it doesn't, why I don't have a turn on option. I feel like I should. Or maybe if I deactivate and activate. There we go. There, that, that's what it needs to be. Never mind. I don't have to do anything of the sort. I got this. I totally have this. And you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to not show off my messy closet. And I'm also going to do this. And I'm going to do this. I swear, everyone, I prep beforehand. And we're, there we go. We're good to go. All right. So, all right. Now we look like this. Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh-huh. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Welcome to, welcome to Kisara trying to make sure that she remembers how things all go. So we're going into moon base again. Last Wednesday we actually started it up with the brand with just the tutorial and getting used to all that. So now we're going to try doing it on that normal mode with none of that other stuff. So just the game plan and the hope. <laughs> all right. So with that in mind, I'm going to start up the game. Huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. I want to make sure. I actually bought Little Nightmares a long time ago. I've been meaning to play it, and I downloaded it. And now I'm like, oh shoot. Should probably actually play it at some point. See Little Nightmares too. All right, and Mune Base. Here we go. All right. And now we'll do this, and hopefully that works. So I can actually put my OBS back on the other screen. There we go. Now I can see things. There we go. All right. So here we go. Cheers to Karma Chimera for suggesting this game. It is absolutely adorable. I'm enjoying it. Cheers, mate. So new game, normal mission. Wait, creative, free crafting. All right, now we're trying to actually survive. I don't. I don't know what to do. Anyway, we're just going to do this. All right. So, name my space cat. My cat's name is actually Wednesday. So, I'm going to go ahead and name my cat Wednesday. <laughs> All right. And my cat is actually... I'm purple, so I'm going to go with purple. My cat is a black cat. So there we are. So Wednesday has to survive in this purple space suit. My poor kitty. All right, here we go. Mission, land on the planet GJR896 and survive for 31 days. 
FYI, you will be dropped on the planet with no base and have to build one before you at 68. So be ready. I, Karma, I am ready. I am ready. I am prepped. All right, here we go. This game kills a lot of new players. So first and foremost is I, how, how, how do I build anything? Oh, here, what's this? Can I open this? Oh, I have a biofuel generator, right? And um, you know, I'm gonna put it right over here. Okay, and I have an air cleaner. I'm gonna put that right there. And space drop supply crates. All right, so far so good. Are there more? Do I have to... Ah, ha, 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 I found it. I shall not die today, Karma. I got an airlock and a workbench. Oh, look at my little footsies. All right. I probably don't want the airlock to be right... There? Is this good? All right? So that's an airlock and here's a work here's a workbench. Mad Matt, how goes Galacticat? <laughs> okay. So Galacticat's going well, I think. Maybe. Am I supposed to find another crate? Alright. Can I go inside? That button to the leftmost. Nope, still dying. I will read that in a second, Karma. Here we go. Oh, actually, no. Show map is good. Map is good. Let's see. That button on the leftmost side of the inventory ensures that you can always craft a workbench to bootstrap your crafting, by the way. But usually one, the one you start with is up. Okay, got it. Two crates is usually it. Ah, uh, well. All right, well, we have an artifact over there. We'll get to that. Okay. Um, can I collect wood? Can I do this? Wood's good, right? Wood is good. Oh, my God. This is fine. This is fine. I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. Everything's fine. Everything is totally awesome. We are going to make... Wait, wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Come on. What? Who is that? Drake, hey, dropping in for a minute or two. I already like the space aspect already. But yeah, Drake, this is all you. Except for it's a cat. <gasps> okay, I have oxygen. I have some oxygen. We are good. We are okay. We're good. We're good and okay. I'm so happy you're here, Drake, to see a little bit of this. I'm not gonna lie. It was adorable when I had it, and I'm already stressed because I'm not like stressed like in a bad way, but I'm just like, ah! They don't connect vertically, made it horizontally. Yep. I think you can hit R to rotate modules. Oh, oh! Okay, so that's something that we've learned. We've learned. We just want to absorb oxygen so we don't die. Seems a good one. Be right back, checking the stove. All right. Make sure you fill your biofuel. All right, so first, we're gonna go ahead and do this. All right, now we're gonna go make some food so we don't starve. Uh-huh, yeah, uh-huh, crafting that. Yes, mm-hmm, yep, now we eat. Cool, all right, so we're good to go there. So now, now I can, I can do nothing. I can, I can find more scraps, what I can do. Okay, I see what you mean by this thing, requires that. Okay. First, I'm gonna collect grass left and right. Be sure to hold on to them. So silk. Wait, pause. <laughs> hold on to some of those self sealing stem bolts for Drake. I know. I need the Cardassians to really get their act together so that we can come to an agreement on the sale of self sealing stem bolts. <laughs> oh my gosh. When you enter the base, your suit oxygen quickly fills from the base reserve. I shouldn't have been left. Once the server is depleted, it takes the it takes a longer replenishment rate. Yeah, I definitely saw that um, right off the bat. All right, that's good for that. But I need scrap. I have wood. Now I need scrap. Flashlight time. 
I know it's gonna deplete my battery, but it's okay. It's okay. We're not gonna we're not gonna stray too far. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh-huh. Uh-huh, yeah. Okay, you know what? I'm going back to the thing. Right? It's north, right? Alright, here we go. I don't need a flashlight. Alright, give me back my oxygen. Base oxygen reserve time is determined by the number of modules. You can kind of walk inside. Oh! Okay, so is it the more modules I have, the more oxygen I can have? Or is it the more air tanks that, that use to deplete it and stuff like that? Alright. So it's gonna... It's gonna do all that. At the very least, we can have ice. Ice is good. All right. You know what? I like daylight. Daylight's great. Daylight is wonderful. I have to survive 31 days, right? K-Dog, hey! Welcome in, man. How are you? I don't know. Come on. Here we go. Sorry I'm late. Just got the shower. We actually just started maybe about six... I was six viewers. About maybe 10 minutes ago at the most. Um, we just started immune base. Started on normal. Going in from here. Good luck with darkness and oxygen. Drake, I'm watching you, Drake. I'll see you when you get home. All right? All right. So, with that, if you build more modules, the amount of oxygen, the cleaner, the air cleaner can store in the base increases. Oh, okay. So, you fully refill them faster as soon as you reach the base. That's why it was so much faster when I had all of those things. Oh, that doesn't look good, right? That's bad. That's bad. We stay inside. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, it's raining. Can't do nothing about it. So. All right, so now we have... Oh, boy. That's bad, right? Don't be into lightning. Lightning's bad. Right? Yeah? Mm-hmm. All right, let's go find more scrap. Ooh. Oh, man. Now, this is safe. This is totally safe. This is a good thing. This is a good thing. Uh -huh. Totally safe. Definitely a good idea. Go outside. Right? Right. My thoughts exactly. Mm hmm. Look, see, it's gone. I need a different tool. Okay, so. I can have water. This is more like Don't Starve. I only have watched people play that game. I've actually never personally played it, but it looked like fun. Hard as heck, but it looked like fun. Like I said, everyone, I am really glad everyone is here to watch me figure out how to survive as my little kitty cat. This is Wednesday, everyone. Wednesday is actually my cat's name, like I said earlier. So, Wednesday needs to survive in space. And so help me if I can't let my cat survive in space. Because that would be bad. Alright, so we're going to craft one of these. We really only need one. I will need this and rock. So now I can actually get rock. Oh! Oh, I have to eat! Oh my god, I almost forgot to eat. Which is actually something I really do in life. So if you if you actually notice that I forget to eat, I actually don't remember to eat IRL in real life. So, ah, I can't pick up this. Oh wait, Cinder. There we go. Now I can get it. Give me rocks. All right, and give me ore, ore and rocks. This is quite cute. I'm gonna die of oxygen deprivation, aren't I? Alright, or rocks, and time to go back and get some more oxygen. Mm hmm. See no sprinting in this game. Oxygen time. Maybe consider moving your face cam up a little so it's not blocking the first inventory slot. Gotcha. I'll pause that real quick. Let me do that for you. You have to build a mune buggy? A mune buggy? Guys, gold. Mune, gu mune buggy. Yay, I'm going to move it on the right side. It's just I'm going to move it up. Alright. Mm 
right, now I'm gonna go back into my thing because I need to see. <laughs> I need to see if that works. There we go. There we go, that should do it. Now I'm gonna lock it in place and we're good to go. <laughs> I get this Lexus in the streams look. Sometimes, sometimes we're like that. But I got what you are saying, so you are all good. All right, so now we can make a smelter. So I'm gonna craft one. Luciana! Yep, only 18 minutes. Luciana, you are well in time. How are you today? I hope you are doing well. Wait a second. Wait a second. How do I... I need electricity for the smelter. Well, all right, well, we have lots of that, so I'm gonna get some, get more ore. I need rocks too, and I need something to eat. And water's usually a good thing, and scrap is a good idea. Uh huh, yep. You're actually covering the spot where the text appears to say, <laughs> oh, switch sides. Oh, I see, I gotcha. Okay. I got ya. No problemo. I'm going to here, however. Do that. Now I'm gonna switch sides instead. Some more like over here. I can put it down in this corner, can't I? Right here? I don't believe anything pops up over there. Okay, I think that should be good. Alright, so now it's dark. And I'm perfectly happy with, with maintaining my spot. Luciana, it's good to have you in. Welcome to Mune Base. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to eat. I need to make the foods. I ate plant slop. Ooh. All right, we'll see how long that goes. I need to research stuff too, right? So, I don't need that, but I do need this so I can actually open up research tag. Wait, let me see what I can do now. Uh, nothing. I can make, what is this? Construction. Or I can make root food. No, I can't do anything. Just kidding. I can't research anything. <laughs> Finding a good spot for face cam in a game interface is a gosh dang art. And I think more game developers intentionally create blank area for a face cam or even stream remote interfaces. This is true. And to be perfectly honest, I should have honestly thought of that beforehand. I mean, I did. So there is that. But thank you for letting me know. And I've adjusted accordingly. Thank you. You need to. We're trying to get to 31 days, by the way. That is, that is the goal. Hmm. All right. I'm gonna avoid the. Avoid all of that. It's a bit hacky, but in the current version, you can interact with outdoor structures while standing indoors. So putting structures close to modules is advantageous. If you move the workbench just south of the airlock, you can work on it from there. <laughs> I gotcha. Let's try it. We'll need to get more food at some point. I get immune buggy. Ah ha ha! I see, I see. What is this? The wood sign can display some items and symbols. Oh, that's cute. Okay, so... Oh, look, some food products. So there's grass. Some fruits. Normal rain, no acid or anything other dangerous. No, we'll go with normal rain, Luciana. Hey, yeah. <laughs> it looks like normal rain. Though the lightning strikes are quite... 
uh, like right in there, so there is that. All right, we have grass. We have wood. We have lots of stuff to the north, so I gotta come back this way. Make sure I can get everything I can. Oh, and another artifact. Oh, and electronics. Oh, man. I got lots of stuff. All right, time to head back. I'll grab the scrap, too, while I'm at it. Oh, three scrap metal from that. Nice. Where am I going? I'm going to the, to the west. Heaven forbid I would get acid rain. Are you trying to make me play, like, Death Stranding? Like, what? What? So I need to build, I need to get this, but I need smelting, but I can't have smelting without the electricity to do it. Does, can I still smelt this? Let me see, I can. All right, so we can make four of those, okay. And while it's doing all of that, I'm gonna go scrap some more. All right. Get some rock. I need my shovel. Hey, no spoilers, I've not played Death Stranding yet. I, the only reason I know Death Stranding is like, just raining, it's always raining. Every time I go into like someone's stream and they're playing Death Stranding, it's always raining. So that's all I know. <laughs> I don't know anything else about the game. So. <laughs> and a baby. I know I know a baby and, and rain. Oh, I can write, I'll eat that to save my skin real quick. I got a plant seed too. Nice. Grab the scrap that I need. So far, it looks like I'm doing okay. I will need to go back for the oxygen. I want to just grab a little bit more of these supplies, and I think I should be able to make it back in time. Yep. All right. So now we're gonna go south. I believe. South southwest. I don't like darkness. I don't like the dark. Hold on, let me just go inside. There we go. Staying up too long is always a temptation. Yeah, I see that. I also can't really tell like sometimes like when the time period ends, but it should be all right. I'll let that fill up my oxygen real quick. Eat my potato. It is. It's F. It's, there's a. It, it's F. I'm just really bad at hotkeys. All right, real quick. We're gonna get the scraps. Oh, I don't have any space. You. All right, we'll crack one more. Yeah. All right. And with that, we'll go back inside and craft. All right, now we'll craft this thing for research. I see this game is only on the Steam. Oh, yeah, I think this one's only a Steam game or a computer or a PC game. It looks cute, I know, but yeah. You could just gob it on all your immune feet. Oh, you're right. <laughs> immune fruit. All right, so we're on day four. We've made it to day four. So, oh wait, where's that? Where is it? I know there's one south of me. Give me, I'm just checking over here again. Ha, found you. All right. I'm gonna grab this artifact. 
Mune base is definitely uh, on there as well as team. Yeah, I just I think Luciana, you're primarily a console player. I don't think she plays on the on the PC, which is the big thing. I'll find I will find some some cross platform games for you. I promise one day. I know they're out there. All right, so that's gonna take two minutes. Oh, why is there no power to that one? Is there more immune fruits I can eat? Yes. I like that I'm eating. My cat would never eat immune fruit. Like, just, she just wouldn't do it. Only on the console or mobile, yeah. We're going back. We're going back. You only have one gen. Oh boy. Okay. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Going home. Going home. Going home. Back to base I go. Right after I find where it is. Hold on. Where's the map? North. Oh my god. Here we go. Oxygen. Whew. Ah. It can't run so many structures. Oh, so I would need more generators to run stuff. I gotcha. I gotcha. That's why you have more biofuel. Okay. 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 It's usually necessary to build a second biofuel filter before getting to the other power techs unless you play really focused. Oh, hey, Mad Mac. Welcome back. I didn't even see you there. My bad. My bad. My bad. Right. So we're in a bit of a pickle. I need another biofuel, but I can't craft it. Because I need metal plate and components. But I can't have metal plates because... Oh, there it goes. Okay, we're good. Space cat game? Space cat game. Exactly. <laughs> okay, this is weird. Why are both stations out of power at once? That's what I was asking. I think it was when I had to like leave. I don't know. I'm not actually sure. I saw it go. Yeah, welcome to my confusion too. I'm kind of hoping that if I leave and come back, it'll be okay. <laughs> What's this? That's a different tool, okay. Hmm. It might be the air cleaner turning on and off. Maybe. Ah, but it's going now. It's going now. And then I'll be able to make some smelting. 17 more seconds. And then we'll be good to go. Uh-huh. And then we'll have an artifact. And then we'll have tech. And then we can build more stuff. Eat! Ah! Ah! Can I eat this? Here we go. We're good. We're better now. <laughs> I did say remind me to eat, right? That was a real thing. All right, so now... I have 20 samples. It's plant slot for you, unfortunately. Okay, <laughs> ah, dog is lurking. Welcome. welcome. Just, yeah, lurking is good. Lurking is good. All right. So, construction is probably my best bet to be able to make stuff, build a more complex base and modules, as well as livable space. So I have an airlock, that's fine. I just need this to be able to do that with, right? So let's go with constru construction's a good thing. I believe. 
Yeah, tools can come later. Construction now. I think... I think that's my best bet. Construction. Oh, cat toys. Achievement unlocked. Yes, yeah, see? Now I need this thing. And it costs 10 samples. Construction is the most conservative option. Cooking will, like, take most of the food pressure off. If you want to play aggressively, you could rush the MK2 suit. Yeah, I could. Also, I should probably get some oxygen while I figure everything out. Okay. So with that, we are now going to research the other thing. I'm going to eat more slop. And then... I'm going to sit here and wait for some... Wait for the oxygen to fill up. I know it's going to take the reserves first, but... Okay. Okay, fine. Fine. I'll build it. I'll build it. Alright. I need this. Two and two. Oh, this is... This is all... All sorts of bad. Alright. Oh, I need ore. Ah, uh, okay. No, this is fine. It's fine. We're going to get ore. We're going to go back. We're going to get oxygen. No, we're going to get oxygen first. Look at my little shovel. It's cute. Ah, it was close. All right, oxygen first. O2. You can drop a log in the generator from inside the base. Oh, you're right. I forgot. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm just going to let that, let that build up. You're getting a crazy amount of rain. <laughs> Too bad you don't have a garden block. I know. I know. This is so much rain. Perhaps chance lightning strike will hit your base and supercharge the generator. <laughs> yeah, that's not a good thing. Probably explode my generator before anything else. All right. So time we need to get ore. I'm gonna get rock too since I'm here. Alright, there's lots of ore over here. Mm hmm Floppy, how are you? Welcome in. Yeah, thank you for stopping through. I really appreciate you checking this out. We're playing immune base. And trying not to die. <laughs> They're pretty basic. But I remember at one point I tried moisture setting or something like that. Oh, girl. Yeah. What is a moisture setting? It sounds interesting. Everyone in the chat is okay with the word moist, right? Cool. Awesome. Alright. Here I have all the ore. All the ore. All the ore. Give me ore. Fun story. I know that... Oh! Oh, I broke it. I broke my shovel. Okay, that's fine. I have some stuff. Oh, I'm almost there. All right. All right, so there we'll have this. All right, we'll just craft four. Easy peasy. Once it's, once it's ready, we'll craft four. Join stream at Moist. <laughs> Welcome into the stream, Prinny. How are you? <laughs> oh my gosh. You always join my streams at weird times. wanted to make sure that everyone was okay with the word moist. It's one of those weird words that no people kind of are like, oh, I don't like the word moist. I'm like, okay, fine, I won't say it. It's a skill. You're entering and exiting at precise moments. Exactly. It's a pretty decent skill. 
I'm just loading up my oxygen because... Oh, and eat. Right, I need to eat. Remember to eat. Uh-huh. And then it's going to be daytime. The goal is to survive 31 days. That is a game plan anyway. All right. So, um... Look at that. I like being able to just, like, do all of my work from outside. It's really nice. It's very nice. What am I trying to make again? A wall? More slop? I'm gonna get more slop because, honestly, I keep forgetting to eat, and Karma is like, will you eat already? Like, Karma's big thing is like, eat! Eat! And I'm like, I'm sorry! Like, seriously. Another generator. Thank you. That's what I was trying to do. Another generator. I needed the metal plate and two of those things. Alright, artifact research complete. Alright, now I can upgrade more stuff. What is this? Storage? <gasps> yes! What's this? Flooring? That's cute. Power? Oh. Arg! Arg! Okay. 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 Ah! First off, we're gonna go back inside and think about this there. Right? Yeah. Cool. Mm hmm Yeah. Then, <laughs> you get construction because it's a prerequisite for storage. Right. Right. Storage is a good thing. I like storage. Storage is excellent. Alright. So, oh wait. I need tech. Indoor storage or outdoor cargo container. You keep your junk safely stored away for later. Oh, what's this? Navigation? <gasps> Recycling? Okay. You can deconstruct the research station and put it down somewhere away from the base to make sure the smelter is powered. Oh, you're right. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Luciana. I am making storage. I know me. I know I'm a big hoarder. Such is the life. Yeah, let go. Here we go. We're going to put this over here for the moment. Yeah, just stay there. We eat some more. And then I'm going to make... I'm going to make a biogenerator. No, I don't. I need this. Wait, I, oh, I need to... <laughs> I need to get my stuff first. Alright, so first and foremost, we need one plate. Tech guy! Hey, man, welcome in! How have you been? I, oh, wait, oh, oh, something's on fire. No, wait, oh no, I have, I have things. All right, so I'm going inside now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's power that. Did I keep my flashlight on? I did, oh, whoops. Good, good, awesome, that's great to hear. I'm glad you are here. We're gonna make this a uh, bio generator. <laughs> this is so great. If you haven't checked out Tech Guy, Tech Guy stuff is really, really great. I know that you're kind of super busy, right? You know? Kind of in and out. I see you sometimes stream from time to time. All right, I'm gonna put this biofuel generator over here, and I'll build from there. All right. Mad Matt said, "Oh, not Mad Matt. Sorry, Karma says. <laughs> Karma says some players keep their life support workstations on separate power grids until they have switches to manage them. Oh, that makes sense." Let's see. The artifact, the artificial atmosphere inside your suit and habitat are has a bizarre side effect of dampening your ability to feel hunger. I just forget to eat, like in real life. Like this is just me. <laughs> I wish I could say that it doesn't apply to my games, but like I don't know. But hey, you figured it out. Wouldn't need a hint from me. Woo -hoo! Every so often, I'm pretty. I pull off pretty awesome stunts. Thank you. <laughs> Tech guy says, it's been mega busy starting summer semester, so IT work is really busy. Plus, I just think I'm a fire volunteer firefighter, so all the call outs, all the time, night or day, busy with that. Oh my goodness, man. Yeah, I can't imagine. Really awesome working on the on volunteer firefighting. I know, it's, I know that can be like all sorts of grueling but crazy, but at the same time, I know you're doing really, really good work. So kudos on that, and I really appreciate all the service you create. Um, 
After that, IT stuff, don't even get me started. I played my PC build simulator. That's good enough for me. <laughs> Let's see. Karma says, I play, when I play, I'm hyper alert to those little chimes that mean something is running out. I would be. Maybe not, actually. I probably, I, that's a lie. I probably wouldn't be. <laughs> I see the charms and then I forget to pay attention to them. All right, let's see what we have here. So I have a smelter. I have this construction thing. So I would need metal beams, this and that. So how much ore do I have? Mm hmm. All right, I need more ore. Oh, let's go get that. What did I need? Construction, none of that. I need electronics, which is wire, which I can do that, so that's easy enough. So that's set, and then I can make this. So we have wire, so we're almost there. We need two metal beams and three of those, which requires all of that, which means I am gonna need a lot more ore. Yay me. All right, so now we're gonna get more oxygen, and while we wait for oxygen, I'll catch up with the chat. Um, Magus, Mad Matt says, it is I, Karma. I have much useful knowledge about this game. You betcha. I mean, <laughs> Karma is the one that suggested the game to me, so I, <laughs> I was giving it a shot. One of those things, you know, kind of kind of goes, and I'm just, like, really enjoying it. Like I said, this cat's name is Wednesday. My cat's name is Wednesday. This is a space cat. My cat is not a space cat, but she lounges like she owns the space, so close enough. Um... K Dog says, "Always, always, is the most unique games I've ever watched. I, I find a lot of interesting ones all over the place. I'm not gonna lie, but sometimes I get games that are rich, that are recommended to me. So Luciana suggested to me Flame in the Flood, which I played and streamed one time, which is super fun, albeit very frustrating, but super fun as well. Um, Karma obviously recommended uh, this game, Moon Base. Um, Prinny mess." Uh, sent me the game to um, Astrologaster, so I stream those. So sometimes it's it's you guys that provide me with awesome games to check out. So I am always appreciative of that. Uh, Karma says, well, if you're seeing chimes instead of hearing them, that's probably half the problem. <laughs> and Karma has jokes for me today. <laughs> I, had, I heard Karma being around. You're, you're, my, you're so much there. Tech guy says, it's so much easier to build a PC versus trying to figure out what's wrong with it software-wise. All right, you have a point there. You do have a point there. All right, so I just need one more of those, right? One more of these widgets. By widgets, I mean the component. Mm -hmm. Which means I just need to make one of those, but I need more ore. I'm missing ore. Who knew I would be missing ore? All right, I'm going to eat some fruit, though. And by widget, you mean sprocket. That, what, what, what? Oh, I need to make myself a shovel. Yeah, I meant sprocket. I was trying to think of it because, okay, in my head, the sprocket is what I was thinking because I know it from the Jetsons, you know? And uh, yeah, so I was like, that's what I'm looking for, but I couldn't think of the name, and so widget came first. <laughs> and now I feel like watching the Jetsons movie. I am not gonna lie, I have watched that movie many times and it's glorious each time glorious by which you mean sprocket karma the world is is so much better with you in it let me tell you <laughs> don't you ever forget that my dear the world needs you uh, we come, we have come from far off year of 2002. <laughs> oh, I didn't even need to make it. Look at that. I got it. Well, I'll get more ore anyway. Yes, George Jessen works at the super advanced robotic in the future that makes gears. <laughs> it's practically steampunk. Are you all right? Oh, it's glorious. All right, so with that, I can actually make a construction thing. I'm assuming that the construction probably needs to also have power, yes? Which means I should probably put it near the the thing, with the thing. Oh, no. Kitty, kitty. You'll be okay, kitty. All right, 
back inside, kitty cat. It's so satisfying when you find a bonus component in the scrap metal piles and match build things with them. I, I know, right? I was like, oh my gosh, I can make stuff. Always sing songy, by the way. This game is all about singing Yoon Cat songs. That being said, if I it will actually start singing the musical cats, stop. Stop me. Like, just be like, no. We're not doing Jellico cats come out tonight. You know, kind of thing. This is Jellico cats come space and so on. Don't judge. <laughs> or judge. One of the two. Alright, so I. What did I do here? Oh, I need to. <laughs> ah, goober. Alright, going outside. I know, kitty kitty. You can do it. Right? I meant to put it next to this thing. Right? It goes next to it here, I believe. Yes. Oh, pff, I need to actually—I actually need to run it. I was like, "Why is it not doing anything?" I need to, I need to actually do stuff with it. All right, let me make some stuff. I'm some slop so that I don't get in trouble. I promise not to judge you out loud. Well, I am greatly appreciative of such a thing. All right, so I need two of these. So now we need two of those. Karma says, sandstorms can kill if you stray too far from the base because they make you walk so slow you can run out of oxygen coming back. I see that. I can see that being a problem, yes. No doubt. I'm going. It's going dark. It's going dark. Okay, it's going dark. I'm going back. I'm going back. I don't actually do well in the dark, like in darkness. All right, I have a flashlight though. Oh sweet, I have stuff. So now, let's make that storage component thing. Yes, yes. Sweet. I'm assuming I don't need to actually have it near a power generator. I can just put it out of the way right here, right? Storage. With Nene. All right, oxygen time. Turn off the flashlight. Usually, you want somewhere convenient, though. I, I mean, huh? Oh, is that what that is? <laughs> Man, are they really still doing that? Let me see. I got this. I got this, man. Don't worry. Just banning. <laughs> but to be clear, there's no obligation to put your base anywhere near your lander. That, that makes sense. I just wanted the storage to be kind of where I can find it again. People always want to become famous. I know, but the sale of followers has always baffled me. All right. I'm going to eat some more, because I know that's always a good thing. Alright. So let's see what else we can find. Well, I'll get these, I'll get these ores, too, while I'm out here. Alright. 23 days left. We're doing pretty good. We are doing great. You know what I'm also going to do? I'm going to go get this plant, this fruit here. I really need the owner's manual on that band hammer you gifted me. <laughs> they they haven't come to my stream so often that sometimes I forget that they're there. So don't worry, Mad Matt. I, I got you. I got you. I also don't remember how to do it. Oh, give me this. Give me that. Give me rocks. Depending on um, depending on what device you're using, Mad Matt. Either it's um. Tap on the name and the, if you're using the, I'm going to pause this for just a second. If you tap on the name uh, in a mobile, then a pop up will come up. You see timeout, ban, copy message, delete, or anything like that. You hit ban on that. If you're using the computer, I think it's right click on that name and then you do the same thing. Just ban it accordingly. Map. Kisara already like Matt Damon famous. I, I don't know if I'm going that direction. Matt Damon has a lot under his belt. <laughs> Alright. Grab some more.
some more ore. Apparently, I just always need ore. Uh huh. Oh, pfft. let me go get it. <laughs> let me go get the ore. We're also trying to keep on the lookout for more research artifacts. I want to lose this super quick. Oh, look! A research artifact. I'm going to go get it. Hopefully, my thing will last. Come on, last level. Oh, sweet, I got it. All right. Honestly, I wish the time goal was like twice as long since I'm usually only halfway through the tech tree when the time limit arrives. Since I play cautiously. You can stay on the planet as long as you like, though it doesn't feel as satisfying when the lander is telling you to depart. Yeah, I can see that. All right, continue north. It's raining, it's pouring, the old cat is snoring. Uh, oh, should probably fix that. All right, so what's next? Matt, there's an auto. <laughs> you survived eight days alone. That's already something. I know, right? I, I think I'm doing pretty good. I think I'm doing pretty good. Oh, no. Wait. I'm not doing good. I'm not doing good. Okay, now I'm good. Now I'm good. <laughs> I forgot to run the... Okay. So, we're going to let ourselves... Oh, look. Lightning struck my stuff. Mad Mad said, tell me I got you. It's like a celebrity telling their bodyguard I got you after chasing off paparazzi while the guard tried to remember how to punch. Ah, it's not what I meant. I apologize. But yeah, no, it's just right click or tap the name and you're good to go. There's an owner's manual for band hammers. <gasps> there could be. Matt's going to write one. Probably not. I mean, you could, I'm sure. All right, so we're gonna research this artifact. And while that's researching, we're gonna go back and get some more oxygen because we actually do need it before we explore some more. All right. I'm actually not hungry. Go me. Oh, let's see, I'm gonna go ahead and create myself another shovel because I'm fairly certain the one I'm gonna have is gonna conk out on me there. Let's see. After that, I don't really have anything new at the moment, so I'm gonna keep holding on to that. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna let my oxygen build. Can you get struck by lightning in this game? I don't know. I've not. I've not really tried to <laughs> to test that theory. <laughs> it's like, I guess I could, but I'm not really in any rush to be like, let me see if I get struck by lightning. You know. <laughs> I, I don't know karma might have the answer can you get struck by lightning in this game karma smelt a bunch of metal and make some more modules so you can store more oxygen yeah it can hit it and kill you question asked and answered all right so let's go smelt some stuff oh i have to build it from here oh okay 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 what's this gate uh-huh what's this metal wall okay airlock i have habitat module okay okay oh boy it's dark it's dark not a fan okay all right so now we're gonna smelt my ore to make these After that, we're gonna have some tech in just a moment. Getting struck by lightning would be an incredible way to die. It would definitely be a unique one. All right, so this requires 10. Recycling, this, power, food. I could make food, but um, I'm doing pretty good so far, so I'm probably gonna hold off to make, what was I gonna make? I was gonna make something. Oh wait, I need tools. Navigation, this is good for 
nav light, saw so far life finding your way into dark. Yeah. Or long range communications. Okay. I heard of this one guy from Korea who has been struck by lightning 17 times and arrived each strike. I have not heard that one, but at the same time, I'm not putting it past anyone <laughs> at this point. You know? Man, I says, the last plane... I'm going to grab this real quick. And now I'm going to make... Oh, no, I'm going to go make the modules on this side. All right, here we go. The last plane I was on passed some lightning clouds in a distance on a descent. It was really something else to watch them flicker in the dark. Oh, good God, yeah. Achievement unlocked, getting cozy. All right. All right. Look at that, 75 oxygen. Cooking also takes a huge amount of pressure takes off a huge amount of pressure if you find the game stressful. Uh, oh, speaking of um, speaking of food, I should probably eat. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't think it's that much. Unless I realize that grass is suddenly disappearing, then I'm really, really stuck. Okay. So with all that in mind, I can now... All right, so let's go exploring some more. He's either really lucky or really unlucky. I, yeah, <laughs> I can't. I can't imagine. Did I not pick a tech yet? Hold on, time. Tools or cooking. Pants are new slowly. It can be difficult for both biofuels and cooking because your fuel is different to your fuel. Oh, okay. Cooking it is. Oh, look. Yay. Oh, no. You can do it, kitty. I believe in you. So moving into better power supplies. Where's my, where's my place? Moving into better power supplies helps with food supplies as well. That makes sense. That makes sense. All right, so let's do our research. Sweets, and we're gonna go get more oxymogen. No, no, we're good, day nine. Not too shabby. I think I should turn that off. My fan. All right. So let's see where we haven't gone. All right, I've gone a lot of west, gone a lot of north. So let's go, oh, sorry, east, let's go west. We haven't done a lot of west. So let's see what we come up with. Alright, we got roots. That's nice. Alright, we have plants. Alright, roots. Hold on to you. Uh-huh. Give me plants. Oh, it's getting dark? I don't like dark. I don't like dark. I do not like dark. Part of the game, by the way, I'm just letting everyone know right now. At some point, if it, if the dark actually becomes unnerving for me, which it actually does, um, like I actually physically get very anxious when I see it, even in game. It's not real, I know this, but at the same time I get very anxious in the game. Um, when darkness just envelops my character, it gets very real, I get very anxious. So I might end up spending most of the darkness just kind of just sitting here, just waiting. <laughs> I forget what that fear is called. 
Are you afraid of the dark? Very much so. Fill my base with torches. Oh, my lights on. Like this? Let's see what happens if I do that. Torch. Oh, that's all light. Okay. It's not too shabby. Okay, so I got five upgrades. I can actually get tools. What about those shadow men? Don't even start with me, Mad Map. Don't even start with me, Mad Map. <laughs> Sturdier shovel, I can get an axe and a jackhammer. That doesn't seem so bad. Or I can save it for more power. So I should save it for more power. Just because. So I'm gonna do that. No, 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 no. I want food. What's this? Oh, I need that. Oh, yeah. All those plants I ate. Oh, hey, look, they come back. I have something similar with underwater. Underwater gets me too. So, yeah, it, I am right there with you. It is an unpleasant experience. A necessary one, but an unpleasant one as well. Alright. Remember all the time when I got all that fruit? And now it's all gone? Well, I have that, so that's a start. I hear... I hear it. I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. Alright, now I'll go back to base. Sometimes I get me not breathing in IRL in this part. Oh, really? Oh, boy. No, please breathe. Breathe. Breathe, Luciana. Breathe. We need you. Now I know, some days it's like that, where it's just like, oh my gosh, am I going to make it? Am I going to be able to <laughs> not hyperventilate? Where's my base now? Oh, it's still north? Okay. I know I'm going to eat. I'm going to eat. I'm just going to get the correct food. Why well, should be in the totally wrong part of the town? Nope, I'm still going north. Okay. Okay, so now... I can make some food. I can make good food. Craft that once. Oh, but I have to make room in my inventory. Mm-hmm. Oh, I know. First and foremost... Let's go to my thing here, and we're gonna drop in blue shrooms and seeds. All right, now we can eat. I hear it, I hear it. I hear the chimes. Yeah! All right, there we go. So now I have plenty, plenty of food. So I'm now gonna go get oxygen before karma messes, gets mad. Don't forget to breathe. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Don't forget the oxygen. <laughs> Ooh, that was bad. Oxygen replenishing. I see it put my torch out. Interesting. Alright. Let's see, what else we got here? Uh, <laughs> a gate? I don't need a gate at the moment. I don't have any research, so that's okay. I think you just need to click on the torch to relight it. You are correct. All right, so now let's go southwest. <laughs> okay. Oh, look, artifact. Good. 
I like wood too. Wood is nice. I hear it. Not a fan. Yeah, we're gonna keep going now. I need that axe. Oh no. Mm -mm. Nope. Back to camp. Northeast. Slightly. Maybe you could leave a line of torches when exploring. I could, but I don't need to wait. I, I mean, I'm, I'm actually perfectly capable with the flashlight for now. Um, Cause I'm not going that far. And even if I did leave a line of torches, they would, for me, they'd have to be close enough. Cause I'm having like no navigational skills. But if I have a map, I'm fine. I'm talking about the darkness anxiety. It's mostly just doing it. It's kind of hard to explain. I could probably pick up... Actually, if I pick up my alcohol, it'll be like Drunken Master. You would never know that I had darkness anxiety. <laughs> and like Rock Lee and Naruto, just like... Look, look, look. I'm going to make it just through. It's true. It's true. Sometimes it's like that. But um, yeah, I mean, that could do it. That could do it. I could make a line of torches, I suppose. What else do I have, though? I can plant stuff now. Now that I have green. Day 11. It's kind of like, too, um, that the darkness anxiety. It's not so much that I, like, I, I don't get stunned. I don't get scared into to not moving. So as long as I'm I'm going somewhere, I should be fine. If I ever get to the point where I'm stunned into silence, then it's probably bad. But I'm, I'm old enough where I'm like, I figured this out. I got this. I conquer. That's the game plan, anyway. Ooh, root seed. I'll turn my flashlight off. Oh, more root seeds. Grow, baby, grow. Oh, I need water? Aw, oh, man, it needs water. Well, if I'm fortunate enough, maybe. Here. Now that it's not raining, I'm sure I'm getting a lot of wind now. Let's see. Where on our map are we? We wanted to go south over here, so let's do south and then west. You ate a hearty meal. Now that I finished dinner, I'm going to get breakfast started. Yay! Any particular reason why breakfast has to come after dinner? Alright, we got an artifact. Now I have 10, so now I can actually upgrade power. There's that switch you were talking about, Karma. Light sensor. Wind turbine, electrical motor. Okay. All right, I'm gonna do power. So, do I construct it or anything? Yes, and I would need two electrics and two metal plates. All right, so electrics. So there's that. And then metal plates. 
are that? So I need wire. All right, so I need four of them actually. Okay, so I need wire. And I have scrap. Right, I have seeds and roots and stuff. Now, why did I do that? That was silly of me. Yep. Okay. Metals. Wire. Alright, so now I have that. But, it needed two of it, correct? I believe. Two of them? Yeah, I needed two. Okay, so I need to make two more. Turbines have a slight advantage over solar panels at the start of the game because they give you power at night. Oh, you're right. Generates power depending on wind stream, but I need to build all sorts of other stuff too. Engine. How do I make that engine? Do I even have an engine? Did I make that? Oh, I did. I did. I did. Later, you get batteries to balance the production and comp 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 <laughs> comp consumption. <laughs> comp consumption later. No, comp consumption later. I can read. I promise. All right. So I need one more of these. All right. But my inventory is full. So I'm going to go up here, and then I'm going to go get oxygen. I haven't forgotten. Oh, go inside. All right, that's that. And then... Two more metal plates. Oh, really? Huh, I wonder why it's not smelting. I guess it's from, yeah, I guess it's too, like from the, what's it called? The oxygen cleaner from before. All right, there we go. All right, so with that, I think I can make solar powers now. No, I can't. No, I can't. Why, do I only have one? Oh. I didn't get the other one. Alright, so now I can craft it. I'm assuming that with solar panel that you would have to still stick it close to other items, correct? I believe it's like gotta be like here kind of scenario. oxygen first and I'm gonna eat should be safe at the moment do I have tools already no I didn't get tools okay so we need to find another research thing and I need to make tools that's the next thing that has to happen um, I want 
I do this now before it gets to be too late? Oh look, I got a blue shroom sheed. The blue shroom, blue shroom, blue shroom. Yep, yeah, mm -hmm, I got a seed. And it's blue. I got a blue seed. SH is like my bane, by the way. <laughs> if you're ever like, man, what is she saying? It's SH is has for many years been that kind of letter combination that has never been good for me. All right, see you back in a second. All right, let's see how we're doing on the map. Looks like we're opening that up a little bit. That's good. That's good. We're looking for another research module if we can find one. If not, we're gonna go kill these creatures. Ah! All right. I was kind of hoping that that was gonna take out that, uh, that item. I'm a very resourceful. What's it called? Shovel there. There we go. Alright, so now I can go back and get that piece of wood, which I absolutely direly need. Alright, we're gonna come up on dark darkness soon, it looks like. So let's see, how far are we from the thing? Alright, so so we can start, I see nothing here, so we can start making our way back. Yeah, look at that, I win. You're welcome back, Mad Matt. What did I miss? We just discovered, we, so we, Went a little further to the north, to the southeast. Just opened up this a little bit. Not particularly anything that's crazy, but I did kill two creatures. So we're on a roll. So now we're heading back to camp, heading toward the northeast. Oh, it's so dark, I'm right there. <laughs> going to give it grass. All right. So now you're a hostile alien invader. I am not. They attacked me. Purely self-defense. I don't go out of my way to attack creatures made of rock. I'm just saying, man, man. I'm just saying. <laughs> they have a small advantage. Since I am a cat. Just sitting, taking it nice and easy. Oh, certainly can't eat the blue shroom. Evil, I'm not evil. That is your version of events. <laughs> it is, and you know who <laughs> wrote it? Me. What if I did this? Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh wait, I can grow it there. Okay, never mind. So I have to figure out what those are for. All right, storing. No, no, store. No, I don't want to take it out of storage. Put it back, put it in storage. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Go inside. Hey, go inside. There you go. Now we can make some water. You need an empty plot. You got a thirst root veg there now. Yep. Yeah. For some reason, I thought it was saying, um, what's it called? You can, you, you can, all right, don't judge. But in my head, I thought that meant that I could use the seed like a water balloon and I would like, 
throw the throw the seed or the blue mushroom and it would explode water into the plot and I wouldn't have to use water. That was my logic that doesn't really have any precedent whatsoever. So, yeah. <laughs> making out those fun life but I, oh look i watered the plant and now i don't need to anymore <laughs> all right so let's go exploring some more shall we let's go to the southeast all right eat this hearty meal we're looking for more research modules No blue equals water in video game logic. Exactly, right? Right? Exactly. All right, let's see how far we've traveled. All right, we're doing pretty good. We started heading toward the south. Oh, yes, I got electronic stuff. Woohoo! Don't need to do any extra. All right, we still got some daylight, so that's good. I cleared more map. Okay, we can start. Clear this up. Uh huh. Yeah, I see you over there, alien. All right, let's start heading back to the north. Oh yeah, more components. Oh, it's glorious. Oh, it feels so good. Let's go east. All right, nothing really there. All right, heading back north and going back to get more oxygen. I'm surprised you haven't popped out a few more habit. I haven't popped out a few more habit habitat modules. Cause I like being outside. Who wants to be inside? No I'm kidding. I haven't popped them out because I just haven't. <laughs> I know why I need to pop them out too. It's because they give me more oxygen at a time. I I I I want to do that now. Oh look, I have a root. Put this in there. Can I take this out? And I put this in there. And I put that in there. Sweet. All right, now we are going to make another module. All right, we're going to make more. We're going to make four of these. Coolio. Well, that, but they also have let you have more surface area to put outside workstations alongside. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. If you haven't noticed, I am not the most skilled, um, how do you, what's the word? Um, survivalist, resource manager. <laughs> That's not my forte, as much as I would love it to be my forte. <laughs> Oh, let's see. Actually, for now, since I don't need the electronics, I should probably store them, too, for the moment. These I can take because I can make more food. More food is always a good thing. Alright, so. What is this? Oh, it's seeds. Alright. There we go. I made two suits. I not need any more? Oh, well, there we go. Eat the rest of that. And now you can make an indoor locker module, too. For the, oh, for storage? Nice.
Ну, The indoor units called combined with the outdoor units in the habitat module. Okay. All right. So now I have that. I don't need that yet. Oh! I was close. I was close. Oh, wait. What am I doing? Pink. Go give me oxygen. And... Ah-ha-ha! Ha. I can make it purple. That's not purple. This is purple. Okay, okay. I This, this is better. I like this better for sure. I'm going to put that in there. Of course, my airlock is busted. All right, so now, wait, why am I, why am I, what, why is my health down? Oh, did I get hit by lightning? Oh, <laughs> oh man, oh man, I didn't even see it happen. Base is losing oxygen. It shall not. You shall not lose oxygen. Look, it's purple. It's pretty. No, oh, what am I doing? Okay, so cables can link up to base modules. Oh, so like, so this conduit is like if I have two separate modules dip separated, I can connect them. So like a module here and a module here, I can like link them. That would be really awesome. That would definitely be way easier. Power switch better manage base powers. Light sensor. Switch it automatically changes depending on the amount of daylight. Interesting. Interesting. I missed you getting hurt as well. I, right? Right? It did not. It did not give me forewarning. Alright, so let's go north. Just for a little bit. Not going to go very far too much. I don't think I have a lot of daylight left. Let's see, come up with. Yeah, cables transfer power so things don't have to be adjacent and you can walk over them. They're necessary for wind turbines, which need some space around them for them to function properly. Okay, makes sense. Grab some wood. Ow. No, I want to hit the alien. Stop. Eh. Oh my god. That was it kept hitting the uh, the ore. I was like, "No! I am the wrong thing." All 
right, straight across. That was funny, but at the same time, lightly terrifying. I felt blocked. Brutal alien carnage there. <laughs> oh man, it wasn't. Oh, it was. It was something. I don't even know what it was. All right, here we go. Taking it easy. Oh. I want to find one research module. Man, I don't know. The map is a lot bigger than it sure seemed, you know? I need an electrical motor, but for what again? Alright, this motor. I need it for something. Oh, for a wind turbine. I gotcha. Okay, so it was one engine, two beams, and then that. You want to find this research module. If at the very least, I want this to be at the like find a research module, create tools, and then let this be kind of like the last day um, that we do before I start closing up for the evening. Oh, nope, 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 wrong. All right, we'll keep going east. See what we come up with here. Oh, here we go, research module. Finally. While we're here, let's go ahead and grab some scraps. See if I can actually find another one just in case. Oh. Hello, Krabby. <gasps> Look! A, a component! Alright, got more scraps. Let's see where we are on the map. Okay, we're doing okay. Ah, shucks. Okay. Don't get hit by lightning. Oh, no. Go away. Oh, jeez. Okay. No, it's fine. This is fine. I am not dying out here. This is not happening. Not happening. I just watched my skeleton light up. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. <laughs> trying to get back to base man i was trying to get back to base i made it 15 days 15 days luciana i made it 15 days uh, i was trying to get back to should have worn rubber boots i hate them over you i was trying to get okay I, I got by, i got by lighting that first time. i was like okay i'm just gonna make it back to base i'm gonna book it i'm not gonna stick around for anything else and then just as i Crossed through that one spot. Lightning came down, like lightning stood up. I was like, no, I gotta get out of here. But it's that big circle. There's only so much circumference I could make. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. Okay. That being said, we made it to the end. I clearly want to call it here, but this was Mune Base. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much, Karma, for suggesting it. As much as as much as it seems like it's a stressful game, I actually thoroughly enjoyed it thank you thank you so much for 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 recommending it oh man <sighs> you were at less than half health no okay karma karma i was at full health and then i got hit by two hits from that rock creature right i promise you this is exactly what i know it was full health when i left i was like okay i have a little bit of oxygen left i, I had like full oxygen and then like maybe not all the way full i had full health full food and full health okay so or full electricity i should say and i got hit by the the rock creature 
when I went to go get wood. Okay, fine. So I left that, and then just as I was leaving, it started to rain. And when I started to rain, um, at the one point, I think I went to go get wood over here in the rain. And then at that very moment, just as I was finishing it in the wood, lightning came and then struck. Okay, and I saw my skeleton. Okay, that's when I said, I need to go back to base. I just saw my skeleton. So I was walking back to base, and that's when I was less than half health because it hit me one time. The second time, I was just in the center of that circumference of the blue spot, trying to escape out as quickly as I possibly could. <laughs> I'm going to have to go back and watch the vibe to see what you got. <laughs> uh, uh, the, the last strike what, didn't heal myself after the last strike. How do you heal during the last strike? Oh, no, no, no. Because I went back inside. Okay, I know what you're talking I thought because there were two strikes that I got hit by. Okay, cool. That being said... I really had a blast with this one. As much as this devastating way to end, I had so much fun, and I hope you all did too. At this point, I'm actually going to end the stream for myself. I'm going to see. Let me see what I got going here. Let's see. Terminator, Omnicoms. Uh, da, da. Trying to see where I go from here. You laughed so hard it killed the stream. <laughs> But that's what happens when it's so good. Oh, my gosh. All right. That being said, I'm going to call it here. I'm going to go raid someone else just so you guys can see someone new. I'm not a huge Fortnite person. That being said, I know lots of people who do it. And I know Mr. Drip Too Hard. I'm going to actually raid him um, because he always comes here. He supports me uh, in my streams. And he's, he's just a really charismatic personality. I hope you enjoy his stuff as well. So we're going to go raid him. I'm going to go cry in a corner over this game. And uh, we'll go from there. This was Immune Base. Thank you all very much um, for joining. Oh, sorry. Heal when you're fully fed. Oh, okay, gotcha. Later on in the tech tweet is actual medical items. I'm sure I will pick this game back up at some point in the future. In the meantime, we'll see what I come back with uh, later. Tomorrow, feel free to check out Drake Karama's stream. I'm actually co-oping with him. Um, this will be evening, uh, sometime around 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in the... Mm, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in the evening, I'm sorry. My apologies. Thank you so much for streaming this. Yeah, if you have more stuff and I'm able to procure it, please always just throw it my way. I know you suggested a couple of games. This is the first one I know I've done specifically, but and it was totally worth it. Absolutely worth it. Thank you very much for suggesting this. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and um, stick around if you can. I'm going to go ahead and tab out and then pull this into my main screen so I can see what I'm doing and uh, do this and do this. I'll let you know when the game gets an interesting update. Yeah, if it does, or when it does, I'll definitely probably stream it at that point as well. I can't spell for nothing. Also, why is my computer acting so funny? Did I get this right? Maybe. Maybe we'll see. All right, looks like it's going in there. All right, in the meantime, I hope you check out uh, this particular person and have a great night and I look forward to seeing you all again next time. Oh, stay safe and bye. Have a great weekend.